In Kanan's parody version of Captain Marvel's first trailer, Carol Danvers struggles to pick a VHS movie after landing in Blockbuster Video. Earlier this week, after months of building anticipation, Marvel Studios finally unveiled the debut trailer for its newest MCU effort, Captain Marvel. While the MCU has previously featured female heroes like Black Widow, Scarlet Witch, and the Wasp, Carol Danvers will forever hold the distinction of being the first woman to solely lead an MCU. Film this year the trailer was a hit with most, racking up over 100 million views in its first 24 hours online. This first look at Captain Marvel managed to make Marvel's latest movie even more of a hot prospect than it had been before with moviegoers. Of course, there were the usual troll responses as well, including those who insisted that Carol should have smiled more in the trailer, which earned an amusing response from star Brie Larson herself on the actress's Instagram story. Related, everything that wasn't in the Captain Marvel trailer One of the most talked about aspects of Captain Marvel's trailer was the hero's initial crashing down to Earth inside of a blockbuster video store. While the chain is now down to a single store operating within the entire U.S., Blockbuster used to be the place to go to rent the latest movies back before streaming was a thing. And despite annoyances like late fees and high prices, many now look back in the Blockbuster brand with a fond sense of nostalgia. It's this nostalgia Conan exploited via a trailer parody that focuses solely on Carol's hunt for a movie to watch in the hopes of making it a blockbuster night after arriving on Earth. Check the clip out below. Unlike the actual Captain Marvel trailer, Conan's parody explicitly sets Carol's crash landing in 1992, presumably to establish what films could be found on the shelves of the blockbuster she's browsing. At Naturally, all the movies she checks out are on VHS, as 1992 was still long before the DVD was introduced. Just some of the titles Carol considers include The Goonies, Weekend at Bernie's, Beverly Hills Cop, and Police Academy. Near the end, she seems to settle on 1989's Batman, starring Michael Keaton, only to ultimately pick 1990 comedy Ghost Dad. Starring Bill Cosby, to be fair, going to the video store did often end in renting something one would ultimately regret giving 90 minutes of their life toward viewing. Conan also can't help getting a little extra dig in at Marvel Studios before the parody is over, suggesting that Captain Marvel's runtime will consist of watching the titular hero first choose a movie, then watch the movie she picked out. Why? Because we're Marvel you'll watch whatever we goddamn tell you to watch. After the truly massive success of Avengers Infinity War, that joke might be closer to the truth than some would care to admit. Source. Conan tags. Captain Marvel.